Tests are underway. Test match three, five test series. Australia lead it 2 0. He loves the aerial and he's as good an exponent as anybody. Look at that. That's incredible service for Harvey. Little shimmy and a shake to come back baseline, a flick towards goal, and it took the deflection he was after. And an early penalty corner for Australia. Three and a half minutes in. Here's Rintala on the right, Haywood on the left. Haywood scored two of these in the second test. Australia's first two goals came via this method. Oh, that's an incredible save. On the last line, Sri Jesh didn't want to be beaten again. And wore that like a champ that he is. So true to Australia to get back into attack. Brand is in the circle. There'll be a penalty corner. Gee, that's just very, very clever stuff from Lockie Sharp. He's doing everything to keep them out in Test Match 3. And again, Sri Jesh comes up big for the fourth time in the first quarter. Manpreet's just going to meander to the sideline and try and extract the error from Australia. Oh, no, he managed to veer his way through and pretty unceremoniously dumped by Jake Harvey, who doesn't like the call. Six or eight, ten players. It's, it's very hard to, to find space, so it's been quite congested so far. The game will probably open up as teams take a few more risks. Well, I think they have seen the same thing because they've started with the full press from the moment that that was pushed back. Very nearly stole one against the traffic. They're swimming against a rip at the moment, India. Now wet full speed ahead, options into the circle. One of those is Brand and saved again by Patak. Well, deserved a goal. It's beautiful hockey from the Australians. Superb transfer and superb disguise pass from Wet. Magnificent hockey. How quick was that? This little looks away one way, tucks it inside. Trap made. Just good goalkeeping. Just got the helmet. Well, the goalkeeping from both Sri Jesh and Krishan Patak has been very impressive. They have been the shining light for India. Six penalty corners saved. A couple of genuine almost gimme field goals. Not that there's any of those at this level of hockey, but Premierships, we've got it. Oh, with a skill from Wickham. Slides in the shot, and there's a handling error from Should Patak. Be a goal. Maybe it's a goal to Murray. Oh, I thought that was inside the circle. The replay will tell us. They want the screen, I think. Craig Murray. So the call, let's have a look at this, because we're trying to get a handle on this. We're watching the ball. There's Wickham. Turns inside, definitely touches it. That should be a goal. Unless it's hit the foot of Craig Murray. But the way he reacted was a stick, so I think that's where VAR would have been very useful. Uh, like automatic doors closing on him. He just snuck out just to get the result but um, you know, they've been competitive they've worked hard to get numbers back good intercept here now they've got to get numbers forward to help the ball carry up otherwise you're going to be up against four or five defenders Armacek with the spin to take them into the circle this is a meaningful manoeuvre trying to jink it up onto the stick slide it back Lalit was there in front of goal but the moment passes Haywood in the attacking half oh lovely one time Anderson had Brand lurking Interesting there, Australia didn't go over the overhead like India does, but the pass from Haywood, he just disguised as if he was going to pass left and slid the ball off his stick to the right. And, and Jacob Anderson knew it was coming, and all he was trying to do was get that deflection. Terrific play. We just nudges it forward, Ockenden. Faked Dilpreet the first time. Anderson deliberately over the back line. penalty corner. Yep, you can't as a defender deliberately just play the ball out, a bit like the AFL rule now. Zalewski the feed. Oh, it was almost there for Joel Rintala. Eight goals in five games. Haywood left it for him and was the dummy runner. A fair noise off the concrete oh, behind the goal. So that was faster than the eye could follow. Just rocketed into the concrete, so it's only missed by inches. Oh. That's just, let's buy some time. Let's get ourselves reset. So Australia ring the changes. Now India on the ball, Abhishek. As a support runner, Suman uses him now into the circle. Good build-up. Did that find the foot of where? Yes, it did. Best piece of transition hockey that India have executed tonight. And it results in a penalty corner and a chance to go 1-0 up. Yeah, to their credit, they've defended well. The longer they stay in the game, it just gives them some encouragement. And they are dangerous on the counter. So difficult here as a defender if you plant yourself. Hard to push it out. It'll be Yulgraj to take it. Yulgraj buries it bottom right. Can you believe that? They've been on the ropes for almost three quarters as Australia have relentlessly pounded and pounded at the wall. In just their second penalty corner, they take the lead against the run of play. Talk about it's the perfect penalty corner flick. It was at a height that's difficult to get your knee to, and it's between the keeper and the postman, and almost impossible to say, particularly when it's with such power. That was just a tremendous flick at goal. Zalewski, Ockenden the circle for Brand. That's the familiar fashion. He takes it and turns baseline and they were hip to that scene though. The Indian defence, Ahmed. Oh now. Well they're appealing to get the other umpire to help. Tim Sheen to come in but yeah. I don't think he's going to change it. I love this from Srijesh. Just let me have a chat. Everybody back away. Firstly initially Brand did really want to pull the ball back in. Maybe an obstruction there. Missed the pass. Flip it up. Play on. Oh gee that's a, I don't think that's an Australian hit. Not sure what Jacob Anderson was appealing for. We said the response would be quick for Australia. I don't know if we realise it would be this quick. 
It'll be Haywood to take it. No, the little trick play. Weir was well read by the Indian defence. They charge it down. Now the scramble in the goal mouth. Rintala, it's paddled away, and it's a big defensive stop for India. Is that a little karma? Luski had that pass find a way through, and now another little scrap, another penalty corner coming up for Australia. Great skill by Wickham. You can see the Australians love to play that ball. That's proud of the middle. They get a striker up to present. They fire the pass in. They make the connection, make the trap, and that's the reaction once you make the trap. You'll see here, Wickham just gets in the way, and it's a little touch. Here, his second effort onto the foot. Is it Wickham? Zalewski. It'll be Rintala. Oh, that's an extraordinary oh, save. Crossbar. Flashback towards goal, and it takes the crossbar. Australia can't buy a goal at the moment. Oh. Yeah, hard to argue. He's uh, been outstanding. Oops, chance here. Little turnover. Oh, stroke. Stroke. Penalty stroke. Penalty stroke. Penalty stroke. Penalty stroke. A rush of blood to the head. Armit knew that he turned it over. Rintala was the man there. So the trap out comes. Out the just, the, just the ball comes off the stick. And as the Australian... Oh, gee. So to level it up here, Jeremy Haywood. So tough. Sri Jesh in split position. And he the Australian deserve. Fires it home to level it up at one all. His third goal of the series. I just saw Colin Batch pump fist with Jeremy Hay. We don't might be a friendly, but uh, the Australians are pretty keen to uh, win this game. I mean, they put a lot of effort in. Yep, Dawson was probably in best position there. Bang it in. Sharp. Jack had got. To Oh, I thought Wetton might have been the option. Dragged into the circle. Oh, Anderson won it back against Harmon Pre. Now goes straight at Armit, finds the foot, gets the call. Wonderful work from Jacob Anderson. Real strength there. He done a lot of running. Just to let the leg strength to make the trap. And the strength is to dish the pass here. Watch him keep going forward. Little back pass from Bram was smart. Opened up the circle here. And Anderson's effort to make the trap. Now James Collins comes up. He scored from these situations for the Perth Thundersticks in the hockey one. We give Australia the lead here. It'll be Haywood. Another kick save this time for Tark. And boy, had a little deflection. No, it is 3J still in goal. Apologies, he's been impassable tonight. Zero from ten on the 11th try. Can he get one in? <laughs> Jeremy Haywood kicks down the door of PR's Rejesh and says, I'm coming in. 2-1, Kookaburras. Well, lucky he didn't listen to me. And he just said, I'll flick one high. So good on him. He's capable of doing that. I'm sure he can flick low too, but this is a beauty. He's had real power. And uh, it just beats Regis for power. Ockenden out in front nicely for Brand. Trademark back to goal, then fires in the cross, and a penalty corner ensues. Oh, he's been outstanding, Tim Brand. Just watched him closely there, and he made two or three leads. His ability to turn and change direction. Rintala and broke down a little bit. Ockenden played it back towards goal. They're well represented on the last line. Sharp had a crack, and a kid, Regis says, no. Sharp can't believe that. How did he save that? And he's hurt too, here's Regis. Into the air. Oh, oh, now that's gone out the back and almost, <laughs> almost he ended over the line. <laughs> and he's the umpire's taken out a player, player down. Never before has an umpire had the better of a player in a physical exchange in any sport, I don't think ever. Yep, and so often that defence has immediately become attacked. 